Hi everyone, it's your boy Wojak here, and today I'm going to show you how to install and set up MetaMask on your desktop and smartphone. First, let's start with the desktop version. To install MetaMask on your desktop, you'll need to go to the MetaMask website, which is metamask.io. Click on the Get Chrome Extension button, and it will take you to the Chrome Web Store. Click Add to Chrome, and a pop-up window will appear asking you to confirm the installation. Click Add Extension, and MetaMask will be added to your Chrome browser. Now that MetaMask is installed, you'll see a Fox icon in the top right corner of your browser. Click on the icon to open MetaMask. You'll be asked to create a new wallet or import an existing one. If you're creating a new wallet, you'll need to choose a strong password and write down your seed phrase. Be sure to keep this seed phrase in a safe place, as it is the only way to recover your wallet if you lose access to it. Once you've created your wallet, you'll be able to see your Ethereum address and your balance. From here, you can send and receive Ethereum and interact with the apps on the Ethereum network. Now let's move on to the smartphone version. To install MetaMask on your smartphone, you'll need to go to the App Store or Google Play Store and search for MetaMask. Once you've found the app, click Install and wait for it to finish downloading. When the installation is complete, open the app and follow the prompts to create a new wallet or import an existing one. Just like on the desktop version, you'll need to choose a strong password and write down your seed phrase. Be sure to keep this seed phrase in a safe place, as it is the only way to recover your wallet if you lose access to it. Once you've set up your wallet, you'll be able to see your Ethereum address and your balance. From here, you can send and receive Ethereum and interact with the apps on the Ethereum network. And that's it. You now have MetaMask installed and set up on both your desktop and smartphone. You're ready to start using the Ethereum network and interacting with the apps. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.